Hey you guys, welcome to another video. Today is going to be a vlog style video because today is November 9th and today is the day I'm going to start writing. I've got enough information in my head and enough information written down that I know about the stories and my characters and I've got it all plotted because as you guys know, I did the 15 beat layout the other day. If you missed that video, go check it out which I'll mention it here again. I am doing a series on writing a book from idea to published book. The playlist is in the description box below if you guys want to check it out. And today is going to be, I think a writing vlog. If I come up with different things, different ideas or different um, subjects that I forgot to bring up, then I will definitely you know, talk about it here, but I think today is going to be a writing day and I'm excited to see how many words I actually get down today because I haven't written anything in a long time, nothing new. So I'm actually really excited. And the reason I have this is for two reasons. I washed my hair last night and I went to wet bed with my hair wet. So it kind of like, it's a mess especially on the top. And second is because it's a little cold in my house and I like to be nice and cozy when I'm writing. So without further ado, let's jump into today's vlog. Let's see how many words I get in in this first day of writing regarding this writing series. And it's actually NaNoWriMo month. And as you guys know, I wanted to try to get a first draft done before the month is over or at the very least before the year is over because I'm writing a Christmas story and I wanna make sure I write the bulk of the story during these next two months. So without further ado, let's jump into today's vlog. Okay, so I started writing and I started doing the regular um, template for a manuscript. So I did the normal carrier, carrier new and 12 uh, font. And then I'm like, why am I doing that? I want to self publish this novel. I don't think I'm going to try to, you know, get it traditionally published, which is usually what I would kind of want to do but I think I just want to write this and publish it myself I'm excited about it so what I'm going to do now is I just looked at my Christmas books and these Christmas books are all the same size and then as you can see mine's a little bigger so I am going to go by this size and I've already downloaded the sorry hold on I've already downloaded a bunch of templates from Amazon that let or KDP that let me know that let me format the manuscript right from the start. So I'm going to do that and I'm just going to uh, record my screen so you can see what I'm doing and how I do it. I'm going to go look and see the size of these books and then I'm going to go find the template and go from there. So that's what we're doing right now. Okay, it's been, God, it is full. Okay, hold on. Okay, so it's been about a half hour, I think, since we last talked. I don't even know. I need to keep track of the time. But either way, I've written, let me turn the camera around, 393 words. I'm not saying they're all good words, <laughs> but they're words. And at least I'm getting a feel for the dialogue and the way my character is going to talk and I'm getting a feel for the opening scene which will help me do the last scene so anyways I right now I'm going to take a quick break we're going to go check our mail because in we have um this delivery parcel that 
they put our deliveries in when they're too big and i think i'm finally getting my book i ordered a book from ingram spark it's the first time i'm getting a book from well not the first time a novel from ingram spark because you guys know i got my book companion journal blah 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 anyways so i'm not even talking about that anyways so we're gonna go for a walk real quick and go check how that book came out and that way i can think about everything i'm writing and get more inspiration Let's go. Well, the camera's about to die, but it wasn't my book. <laughs> so, but it's okay. It was, we went for a good walk and now I'm ready to get back to writing, but the camera's almost done, so I gotta charge it when I get back in, so you guys are probably gonna miss a little bit of the writing when I get back, so, yeah. As you can see, a lot has changed since we last spoke. Where is it? I took, I don't know where it's at. Took my beanie off, cause it got hot. We went for a walk and when we got back, as you, can, as you know, my camera died. It's 3.15 now, and I have written 634 words and that's pretty good I'm really happy about that I think I'm getting close to closing up this chapter and then I'm gonna wrap it up I'm not gonna press it I'm not gonna push it I'm really happy right now with what I've got written it's like believe it or not writing this first chapter really clarifies things even more for me because I don't know just sometimes you just have to get in there and write and that's why I'm a big fan of outlining like with Save the Cat writes a novel but I'm also a fan of getting in there and writing so do I think you should just write without having a plan no I've done that before and it hasn't really worked out for me because then I get lost in the middle I don't know the end I don't know the different points that I need to give so I've only done that a couple times with um, this one with um, my book Ugh, let me get it with this one, Falling For You, and with um, my first one, More Than Words Can Say. So, um, so yeah, I've pantsed those two novels. I, didn't, I wasn't a plotter at all, so that's why I'm a big fan of plotting your novel and just getting to know your characters and your story and where you're going and all that stuff. So, really, really close to finishing. So, let's just keep going and I'll pop up on here again in a minute. <laughs> Alright you guys, as you saw, I just wrote 800 words in the first chapter and I'm really happy with the way it came out. Now I can actually move on and just continue on this writing uh, flow. And yeah, so what I did want to say is that I think in tomorrow's video what I'm going to do is I'm going to talk about a couple things that I didn't mention in like my process just because this is like the fifth novel that I write. So there were some things that came to me naturally that I didn't even think to bring up to you guys. So. In tomorrow's video, I'm going to talk about those points just in case this is the first time you are writing a novel um, that you don't miss those steps. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. I hope you are writing along with me. I hope that you are having a good writing month and I hope I'm inspiring you if this is the first time to ever write a novel or if you're considering writing a novel. I hope that I'm inspiring you to do so. And yeah, make sure that you are subscribed to the channel. Make sure that you give the video a like if you found some value in it. And make sure that you hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any of the upcoming videos. So that is it. I'll see you guys in a brand new video next time. Until then, stay safe.